right guys, let's talk about a stupid show today called Haunted Hathaways. First of all, what was Nickelodeon thinking? I mean, uh, applaud, applaud, applaud for Nickelodeon stupidity. I mean, really, this is just a stupid show. I mean, really, Nickelodeon? Are you really running out of ideas for good shows? Because... You can at least allow your fans to, to contribute, but instead you dish out this freaking garbage on a freaking poop ladder from freaking poop merchants for people to consume because people nowadays can't tell the difference between a good show and a bad show. Also, people can't tell the difference between a freaking original show and a freaking unoriginal show. I mean, what the frick? I mean, Haunted Hathaways, this is just a failure. This is just another epic failure from Nick. I mean, the character concepts are just horrendous. Frickin', let's see. It lacks originality, and the story plot is just horrible. I mean, this show is an abomination. I mean, is this, is this really what Nick has become? First of all, let's get on to the character concepts. So, first of all, we have the mom, and she's a freaking Mary Sue wannabe freaking she always tries to act perfect she always acts like she's in some type of drama flick i mean this isn't a freaking drama flick i mean seriously i mean isn't this a freaking channel for kids i mean no one wants to see this freaking mom always whining about how she wants to be perfect I mean, no one really cares I mean, what the frick and if you think that's bad well look at the older sister always complaining always afraid and I mean, oh a ghost I mean, what the frick always have to complain about that. Oh, no, you can't be here. I mean, seriously, what the frick? She's just an annoying character. And, I mean, she's not even funny. They try too hard to be funny. It's obviously scripted. And, let's look at her younger sister. I mean, she's supposed to be... A freaking tomboy always saying, Well, that's so cool. Ooh, that's cool to everything that her older sister thinks is creepy. So basically, oh, she's her older sister's opposite. I mean, she just comes off annoying. It's annoying, Nickelodeon. I mean, what the frick? It's not even funny. It's not even cute. It's, she is just a nuisance. She's a fool. She's a chump, and she doesn't deserve to be on this show. And now let's talk about the ghosts. First of all, let's talk about the dad. He always tries to act like he's perfect at everything. He always tries to act like a show-off. He always tries to act like he's the best one. I mean, what the frick? He's freaking not. He's just lazy. He's a freaking... He's a freaking gangster wannabe. And he's just stupid. I mean, he's lazy. And he's not even cool. He doesn't do anything. And he's useless. And now for his son. First of all, the older son, he tries to freaking fit in and, you know, be friends with people who aren't ghosts, which isn't a bad thing. But he often comes off annoying, often comes 
off as an urban punk wannabe. I mean, he's just annoying. And, I mean, this is just stupid. I mean, I mean, he doesn't want to be scary, but, I mean, seriously, I mean, he's just, he's just a moron. He's a freaking moron. And if you think that's bad, well, you should see his little brother. His little brother always tries to act scary, but fails in the end. It's the same joke every time. Except, oh, maybe one time he turns into a ballerina. And one time he turns into a guy in a banana suit. Oh, and one time he he turned into a freaking teddy bear, which is obviously a puppet. And they couldn't really get any good animation or special effects. So, I mean, they, they just use... Bottom of the barrel, cheap technology, because this show is so freaking low budget, it's not even funny. And, I mean, the story plot, I mean, I watched one episode and never watched a full episode again. I watched a few scenes, but never a full episode after that. But it's not like I was expecting much, really. Because after Marvin Marvin, I knew sitcoms on Nickelodeon were officially doomed. And, and we have Sam and Cat, but it's not even original. And they just use characters from previous shows because they couldn't really come up with any more good ones. And it's just freaking stupid. But anyways, and... First episode of Haunted Hathaway is so horrible. I mean, he's just dumb. And they hired ghost exterminators, which, which, which they fired in the end. And let's see, they tried to be helpful, and some of them tried to act scary and frighten them out of the house. It was just stupid. I mean, the show's just so dumb. I mean, after that, you can't really expect any of the other episodes to be good. Because if the, if the premiere episode is bad, that usually means the rest of the show is going to be bad. It, it can't get any better. And you know what? This show just freaking bites. It freaking stinks. It, it, it was just dished out on a freaking poop platter. It's just so dumb. This show lacks originality of any kind. Nickelodeon couldn't come with any actually good ideas. So they just dished out this garbage. And Thundermans is unoriginal too. And if they can't come with a, original ideas for sitcoms, then just stop making sitcoms and just go back to making lots of good 2D animated shows like they did during the 90s and, you know, the early 2000s and, early, you know, early to mid 2000s and just make Nickelodeon good again!